Today we're talking about a revolutionary product which has been made available to us gardeners, which farmers have been using for many, many years. What it is, it's called Humigrow. Now, Humigrow is from Ledonite deposits. Now, what does that mean? It basically means it's a form of carbon that's been made available to us. Now, carbon is the basic building block of anything. And now we have it available to you as a gardener. For me, that makes me really excited because looking at South African soils, many, many of them are depleted, lacking in the basic elements. These days, with the onset of granular fertilizers, we've kind of just become stuck in that rut of how to feed your plants. But we've got to remember, if we get the soil layer right, the rest looks after itself. So Humigrow being your basic form of carbon, works like this. Take a look at these little boys. So it comes with a little wooden spoon. One teaspoon of your spoon is five grams, which is the basic measurement that we've allowed for you to mix it into water. So take a look at these little boys. These are them here, nice and small, very, very compact. And to show you how it works is to take one teaspoon, pop it into this because I want to show you how quickly it becomes available. So as I'm busy stirring, you will immediately see the water's changing color. Aha, which means liquid form, carbon now available to our garden. What does that do for my garden? Well, number one is when you're adding carbon, you're building soil. When you're building soil, you're doing a couple of things. Number one is you're gonna make the nutrients that are available in the soil or just sitting in that soil more readily available to your plants. Also, it's going to improve the structure of your soil. So when we've got improved structure, ha, huh, what does that mean? That means I've got better water holding capacity. That means my plants aren't gonna dry out and get stressed out during either very, very hot days or very, very cool days. It also means that my porosity is going to be better. That means the air available in the soil. So it's not gonna be a compacted soil. This, of course, all takes time. As a good farmer will tell you, it takes many, many years to fix the soil. And something I read the other day, which really is important, is leave the soil in a better state than when you first found it. And that's exactly what we're gonna do when we're using something like Humigrow. There are various ways of applying it. Number one, you can apply it into a watering can. So you mix either one sachet, and one of these guys, you getting three little sachets, so it's for three applications, five grams, which is one teaspoon, into five liters of water. Mix it up and you can apply that as a drench directly to your garden. What can you apply to? Anything where you want to improve the soil, but directly to your bedding plants, onto your lawn, into containers, into your garden beds, anything you simply want. The other way that you can apply it is by mixing it in with a granular fertilizer. So it's 50 grams of Humigrow per kg of fertilizer. Simply mix that in and then apply your organic granular fertilizer just as normal. The next way that you can add it into your soil, especially when doing container gardening, is mixing it in with your potting soil. So the same rules apply as you were doing it. It's five grams into five liters of product. All right, so that would be potting soil. Pop it in, mix it all in well, and off you go. Of course, that can also be used for your compost when composting your garden. So remember guys, Humigrow is incredibly safe for your garden. It's safe for you and it's safe for your fur kids. It's safe for the ladybirds, for the butterflies, for all the good things that we want in our gardens because those are the beneficial things. We don't want to harm bees because they are really important. None of this product can ever, ever harm it. In fact, it's so harmless, it's good enough to take a swig of. <laughs>